Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Mario Party 2, and we're in uh, Western Land, and it's lost five turns, and I am pretty far behind everyone. I'm not so far. I'm. I have the coin star, which is good. Luigi has the happening star, I'm pretty sure. And the minigame star, I'm pretty sure it's me, but it could be Luigi. Lost nothing. Now I'm positive I have a point, so I don't think Luigi ever got higher than 90. Okay, new mini game. I'm pretty sure it's a new minigame. Look away. One versus three. Basically, the three player, or everyone looks in a certain direction when the counter stops. And if the one player is looking in the same direction as you, you'll lose. And by the way, center like that counts the direction as well. And if they get, if you, if that person gets everyone within five turns, then uh, uh, that person wins. But the three players, if one of the players survives, then oh, I missed. They, it's pretty like you know, if the player gets all three of us, then uh, oh boy. We lose, but if uh, playing a song of time, right, middle. So far, I did right last time, now I did middle. Now I'm gonna do down. Yeah, you can do stuff while you're dead, but it doesn't do anything. And then I did down. I did the song of time. Alright, again, the George mask on the mind. Left. I don't know why I did left. Jeez, my head's so tiny. Thank you, DK, for the generous offering. And thank you, DK, for doing good. Okay, I'm 100% positive I have the coin star now. They never went over 100. It's a pretty nice song. This game does have pretty good board music. The first three games all had really fantastic board music. Still a star from Mario, he has negative stars now. Oh god. This is bad. That's no good. Where's the star? I have no idea. Hi, Yashi. Well, everyone's ahead of me, so there's like no chance I'm getting it. Okay, so where is it? Luigi. Do I want to? Well, I, don't, I, I could just bet one coin. Oh no, I won't. Never mind. Whoops! I guess I didn't think the red space was actually a space or something. Oh boy, platform peril again. We've got roll call. That one's fun. So platform peril. Uh, you know, mini game. It does stuff. I like being in the middle on this mini game. Because then the the edges of the moving platforms will get you. I miss my coin. Like, see, both times when I played this mini game, the platform has freaking screwed me. Seriously, I'm being freaking serious. That is ridiculous. That both times I got lost. I basically lost because the platform was the freaking wrong place. Okay. Why does TK keep winning mini games? It's my coin star, my mini game star. Jeez, there's like no way now. Oh I could buy an item from the the shop. Like since I'm in last, they'll probably give more generous items. That could be my ticket to victory. No one's in your way to victory. Oh boy. So I still have nothing to talk about. I don't know why. I just could say let's plays I'm watching. Slim Kirby, I'll start with him. Uh, he's still doing my hated Let's Play Fire Emblem. 
Radiant Dawn. I'm, s I'm still watching it. It's entertaining. It's just that it's freaking annoying to me. It's just annoying that he freaking... Like, oh, now I want to do it. I'm, I know I said I want to do it, but I'm gonna do it. What item does Yashi have? Yeah, you can, the only way you can see is by pressing the gold mushroom. I'm gonna... No, I have to get rid of my skeleton. Get rid of my skeleton key. I want an item. What? You can't get rid of them in this game? Oh, that's freaking dumb. The... Oh, I thought you could get rid of them. DK, steal my item, please. Okay, lights out. There's like no way I can win. I'm pretty sure it's impossible. Why does he keep using the upward slash or smash? It's a lot waste, and especially because the opponents get squished instead of getting hit to the side. Oh my god, that was so lucky! What the heck was that? Oh my god, I w if, he, if we had one more second, I would have died. That was ridiculous. Did DK still Yoshi's star? Yeah, he had to have. Okay. There's like one way I can win. DK. Yes! Okay! He has no use for that anyway. Thank you so much. So yeah, and he's also doing Let's Play Kirby the Crystal Shards. Uh, I really like making that project, it's really entertaining. And he, of course he's doing his, uh, he's still doing his weekend new project, Yoshi's Island, Extra Lovers. And, uh, Shadow Mario 41, he actually started Mario and Luigi's Super Superstar Saga, and that game seems really interesting. He's doing a great job with it, that, that's definitely what I'm excited for. Uh, next is, uh, Make Free 400, he's still doing Harvest Moon 64, again, I'm, I'm not really interested in that. Um, I'm kind of waiting for it to be over, which is still like 20 parts away, as I've heard. Oh, dude, I just forgot to reset the timer again. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Reset the timer. Okay. It's gonna be dumb doing that, but... Because, you know, I can't go farther than... You know. Like, I can't, uh... Go past the turn if, uh... Something. 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 Now, come on, here we go. Fine. Magic lamp, okay. I was kind of looking for a boo bell, but I'm not even sure those shops sell that. This way. I feel lucky. I feel lucky, yes, that's a word. It's totally a word, look it up! Okay, tile. Is this the one? Yeah, we've already played this one. I, I knew we played this minigame, I just wasn't sure if it was called Tile Driver. I, I don't know why I thought it was like I can think of another game. Okay, Goomba. Okay. Stop. Okay, I would I would have lost if I hit that Goomba again. Hit boost, you know, hit boost once and hit boost twice. Okay, yeah, I won, definitely. Everyone else did terrible, I don't know why. Even I did pretty bad. Yay! I got it! Yeah. 
yeah. Uh, yeah, that baby Bowser can give you five coins. I'm not sure what triggers it. It might be every one in ten times you pass him, or in the last five turns he doesn't more. He like he it does it every other time, or I, I don't know what triggers it. Or if you're losing, you have a larger chance of getting it. I'm not sure. Ooh, a battle that can maximum from seven coin wagers. I don't know what that. I don't know what that that one is. It was like a battle that can that can. A five coin battle. Shut up! Oh, we actually can show off the duel game. That's good. Basically, um, you have to press A as soon as Koopa, er, as soon as Goomba says go. If you press it beforehand, you lose. I don't know. If I played that, I might not have won. That's kind of one of the more difficult ones. Well, I think the worst one is the last one in Bowser's board because that's just really dumb. Um, let's see, space one. Miss, what's the mystery one? Oh yeah, yeah, that's a uh, that one's easy. Okay, use the item. Use, Usi, Use. us, usi. That's what it is. Usi, not use. That's how it should be pronounced. Stupid English language. So here's the mushroom genie. He'll take you directly to the star because it's incredibly cheap. We flying high in the sky. I don't know how he doesn't suffocate. Wait, what am I saying? He's been in space before. He's in space in this game. Yeah. That's actually not the only. That's actually not the only time in this game where you see the planet. But it won't be a while until you see that. Yeah. Ah like when you see that shot of the genie running. Like you, not the genie, but like something in space with that exact background. The only person who can get that is me, and I'm pretty. I don't think it's possible for me to get that unless there's like some weird move forward space, and it's in the middle, so I can't really use the the train. And of course, I ended off with a red space. Joy, Magna Carta, Sky Pilots. That's okay. It's a new one, at least. I think it's a new one. So this mini game, basically, one player. I think it's me. One player. It controls the speed of the plane by going up and down, and one player steers it. And basically, you just have to get to the end. This one's also really fun. It's kind of like, uh, uh Bob's Dead Run, but it's not nearly as fun as Bob's Dead Run, because the controls are kind of awkward, and the uh, computer players really suck at steering. And if you go through those rainbow rings, you get, uh, speed boosts. You know, at least we're going through speed boosts. There's cannons, and those can be a little annoying. There's also a couple other hazards later on. There really should have been a better job for the, uh, the two player, the second player, instead of just controlling the speed. Just gonna be like always maximum speed. Yeah, Bowser balloons. Luigi, you completely ran into that. Luigi, are you serious? You ran into two Bowser balloons in a row. You were so stupid. I think, like, it would have been cool if there was a minigame where, like, uh, it's kind of like this, except instead of the second player controlling the speed, one player controls the horizontal motion, and one player controls the vertical motion. Okay! 54 seconds is a record? Jeez, must have done that with two humans. Okay. I mean, I know we did terrible, but I mean, that's a really good record, even if we did do good. It's like the exact opposite of what beginning was, but Luigi wasn't first. Well, it's DK wasn't third. Okay. I'm in last for stars. In, la in first for coins. I know I got the coin star, but did I get the minigame star? Yes! I was gonna say the B word, but it's not 19 a.m. It's not it's, it's not 2 p.m. So my dad's awake, and I just don't like saying it for my family anyway. <sighs> okay, I'm pretty sure that Yoshi doesn't have more points than me and has two stars. 
superstar is me because you're all idiots. That's what Toad was saying. That Toad is a superstar. He is awesome though. Toad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but this is all the coins we got. Listen here, bank banker. You got ugh, freaking bad reading. Who's over there? Who votes? Who's over there? Thank goodness it's you, Deputy Mario. Of course. I don't know why I'm saying it, but yeah, basically Bowser around the bank, and Mario, uh, is gonna save the bank person. And watch this. Draw. Uh, Bowser already said that. And they both shoot. Bowser seems to shot first. What's going to happen? Bowser, you're the worst shot in the entire world. Yeah, twirl that gun, baby. Thank you, you saved me. I owe my life. You did real good, Mario. You're the real superstar of Western Land. Alright, let's be quiet for his victory thing. Other than Wario's, that's my favorite. That's definitely the coolest one. Or, the second coolest one. And I freaking won somehow, even though the entire- Like, basically... Halfway through, I completely got destroyed by Donkey Kong and Luigi. And Yoshi somehow snuck up behind everyone and punched them in the backs and stabbed them in the chest. Or the other way around. Okay, detailed results. Just after everyone. Coins, you know, blah blah blah. Game coins. Okay, I dominated. I don't know what the heck. And Luigi got second on that. Maximum coins, I dominated again. Yoshi did worst. Yoshi did worst. Yeah, I can believe that. Okay. Six red spaces. If only the red star was in this game, it would have gotten even better. And Yoshi went. Yoshi landed on. What? I could have sworn Luigi landed on two. And two battle game, two Bowser. Nine battle and uh, nine item games, one bank to land on. The banks are kind of out of the way in that board. So, yeah, S epic come from behind victory. I don't know what the heck was that, that, what the heck that was. And we also got 10 stars for our bank and a ton of coins. It was a pretty intense game, I must say. Uh, I didn't really do much, like, strategic, other than I not steal stars sometimes. But the computers, they did pretty good. I, that was actually a pretty tough game. I uh, really had to get ahead on the Game Star to win that. And I did. So yeah, thanks for uh, watching. If you feel like it, vote for uh, one of the three boards. Horror Land, Mystery Land, and Space Land. And I don't think about it. If you feel like voting, that's great. If you do vote, I will give you a shout out. I will, I promise. It's gonna be, uh, oh, before I go, there's one thing I have to mention. This is the N64 version. This is not the Virtual Console version. This is on the Virtual Console. It's the only Mario Party that's on the Virtual Console. And it's ridiculous since I much preferred Mario Party 1 on there because of how annoying the rotating the controls of the games are. But I guess this is the favorite of most people, so I can see what, I mean, like Mario Party 3, that'd be kind of ridiculous if they did that one. But this one, I I just hope they release one eventually. If they release, if they don't release it, that's ridiculous. Actually, I think they don't. I think that they won't release it because they don't want people hurting their thumb on the GameCube or classic controller and getting sued again, as they did with the first game. So yeah, if you want to vote for Harland, Mysteryland, or Spaceland for me to be next, um, I would be super happy if you did that. I'd be so happy. Um, but if you don't, I'll do Spaceland next. And, yeah, I, I know no one's going to vote, but if you do, I... Bravo, dude. Whoever vote, If you vote for a board, bravo. And whichever one gets the most votes will win. Horrorland, Mysteryland, and Spaceland. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys for that. Um, again, I'm not going to be here next week because I'm going to be on vacation. So, I'll see you guys... What well, late? I'll see you guys on the 9th of July for which most likely Spaceland or one of these two if anyone feels like voting for them. Later!